so what's good? What's popping? What what what's happening, gang? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys don't know me, my name is Blue Dakota. And if you guys do know me, then welcome back. Gang, if you're not a part of the game, then go subscribe to join. And that's what that's on, period. What's up, fucker? I know y'all hear something in the background. That's the TV, but don't mind it because actually I'm not going to be talking this video to do the intro. So before I start this video, I want to go ahead and do my subscriber shout out. Today's subscriber shout out goes to period poo if you guys want to be my next subscriber shout out make sure to like subscribe and comment follow me on instagram at brennan dakota and brazy brand it's on the screen and in the description below like some comment dm me on there to be the fastest subscriber shout out and yeah without further ado let's just jump right back into this video all right gang so in my last video i told you guys that i was going to be showing you how to do some customized jeans this is my first time trying this and i'm going to be showing you guys the method with just glue instead of sewing it because i feel like if i sewed it it would have made the cloth like just tighten up and then the jeans wouldn't be as good so I decided to glue it and um though I think this was the best glue to use no I think I need to get adhesive glue but you guys are going to see that throughout the video right now I am just showing you all the supplies I used I used um two things of gorilla glue I'm pretty sure a yellow bandana a black bandana and a purple not blue purple <laughs> bandana i cannot stress this enough a lot of people just uh, it's not blue it's purple it's a really passed out purple it's really pretty though and i use these white jeans that's kind of like capris now so i was like i'm gonna cut them and just make them into some shorts what you guys will be seeing in this tutorial so this is my first time ever doing customized jeans and I think for my first time, it's really good. I'm going to just invest in more supplies. But I don't want to talk too much in this video because that's going to make it extra long and extra boring. I'm going to just describe the little things that I'm doing. And you guys can stay tuned and just watch and see how to make it period. So right here, I'm just going to be taking the bandanas and folding them in half, but then folding it in half again. Well, really, fold it in fourths or however big you want your boxes to be, and then I'm cutting it in half. So I'm going to do that for all of them until they're all perfect, because I low-key have OCD, and afterwards, you guys are going to see me clean it up, like the boxes. If it looks weird, I'm going to cut them again. So just enjoy watching me box custom boxes is very much worth it oh boy you ain't dumb on this one
Oh boy, this shit bang. Here I'm going to be using a magazine to put in between the top layer and the bottom layer of your jeans so that the glue that I use does not leak through and make the top layer and the bottom layer stick because that would be really tragic. It could actually ruin the cloth. It's not going to stick it together because when you put your leg through it's going to rip it. But it could ruin the cloth. This is a good tip to use. And here you can see I'm just going to take each one one by one and lay them down and glue them in whatever direction it fits because i didn't have a certain pattern when i did this but it just came out good so oh boy you went dumb on this one Oh boy, this shit bang
I'm on this one. So this is the end result gang Please mind that yes This is my first time doing this I'm definitely going to be doing some longer full jeans And they're going to be different So make sure to stay tuned for that I recommend other tutorials and DIYs For me to do down below Yeah that's the end of this video Hope you guys enjoyed Make sure to like, subscribe and comment Tell a friend to tell a friend about my channel And I'll see you guys next time on my next video